Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we are going to be doing November's Mystery Tackle Box unboxing. Let's see what we got. All right, let's open it up, see what we got. Bam, we got another ruler. Yep, they've been doing this pretty much every month. So if you're ordering Mystery Tackle Box, get ready to get a free ruler every single month. So at least you know if you get a fish this long, it's a good fish. I mean, the maximum length is 18 inches. So yeah, it's gonna be a good fish. Now, let's see what we got. All right, here we go. The first thing I'm gonna take out is this little card, which basically resumes what you're getting in this month's tackle box. And to be honest with you, this month we're only getting four baits. Last month, I think we got five, if I'm not mistaken. Um, you could check out the video, uh, but I think we got five baits last time, but they look to be pretty decent. For starters, we have the Gunfish Lucky Craft bait. Now, this looks to me like a popper. So it looks to me like a top water lure. Um, it doesn't specify what kind of a uh, bait it is, whether it's a diving bait or whether it's a top water bait, but from the lip here, or the lack of lip, it looks like it's a top water bait. So one of those uh, popper style uh, top water baits for you to go ahead and uh, just pretty much fish on the top uh, and get a reaction strike from the fish. Um, it's a nice little color, look at that. It's a nice little golden color with a black uh, back right here, a nice little black dot. It's a really nice looking bait. And this one retails for $16, so $15.99. So right there, just with this bait, if it really retails at $15.99, just this bait alone pays for the membership of the Mystery Tackle Box. So, not a bad first bait. Next, we have the Super Twitching Shad. Super Twitching Shad from Charlie's Worms. Now, the brand is Charlie's Worms. This bait is not a worm. It's a shad style swim bait. So let's take it out. It smells nice. Mm, it actually smells kind of hard to tell what it smells like, but it's a sweet smell. Not bad. All right, check it out. This is the bait right here. It's a little paddle tail. It's a little paddle tail right here in the green color. And the cool thing about it is that this one actually comes with the jerk bait, or I'm sorry, with the jig that you could use to fish this little bait. This is the first time that I've seen where a soft plastic bait comes with its own jig head already for you to be able to use and rig while you go fishing. So that's a nice little thing to add there. This little jig right here with uh, red eyes that looks really, really weird. But still, nice little jig, nice little bait, a nice little paddle tail swim bait. So uh, this is actually pretty nice. And this one retails for Five bucks. So four ninety nine, right here. The second one, four ninety nine. So not a bad. And it's actually a pretty. It's a full pack. It comes with like nine or ten, if I'm not mistaken. So pretty cool. It's not a tester pack. It's actually a full pack of the shad baits. Not not a bad way to to start this month's unboxing. Moving along, we have. Salt Runner Road Runners. What? No idea. But that's what this is. It says here for large trout and panfish. So this looks, it kind of reminds me of a little, um, it kind of reminds me of a spinner bait because it has the jig head. You see, it has the jig head, but it also has a little spoon, a little a blade that's gonna be turning. Now, the only difference is that it's actually on the bottom of the jig head. It's not at the top. So 
on regular spinner baits you have the jig head you have the the, um, the hook and then you have the spinner coming from the top of the jig head on this one you actually have it at the bottom and to be honest with you i've never fished this kind of jig so i don't really know how to use it if you've ever used this you know this kind of uh jig head with the spinner on the bottom leave a comment down below tell me how do you use this because i've never really used this before this one is actually a new um presentation for me so if you've ever done something like this or used something like this leave a comment down below tell me how to use it because i've never really used it this um this little jig here uh, a pack of three one eighth ounce and number two hook retails for 225 again i've never really used this so i'm not sure how to use it so please if you do know how to use it leave a comment down below to be honest right after this since this is 15.99 everything else that you're getting is bonus baits because this pretty much already paid for the box that you purchased so these baits are here even though at least this last one the spinner one is not something that i'm accustomed to using it's free baits so maybe you guys could give me a suggestion on how to use it and lastly we have inshore fish favorite bait shrimp this is a uh, big bites saltwater edition and it's shrimp tails and this one retails for two dollars so it's this pack always advertises you know redfish flounder and trout if you guys have ever used this to catch any of those species let me know down below um i'm not really big on using artificial shrimp when it comes to fishing inshore i usually just use regular shrimp or you know squid or uh stuff like that uh squid shrimp pilchard stuff like that is what i really use i really don't use artificial too much but i'm starting to think that i have to try to use this for fishing because at the end of the day i'm always going to catch something on real bait so this is a more of a challenge so i'm going to start trying to use this in my uh, presentations when i go fishing off a of pier and lastly the most important part of the box you ready you ready for this Poof. lucky tackle box sticker i know you guys love that so that's what came in this month's box as well with this as well as um this little dibble magazine you know it gives you little tips and pointers on how to fish different uh areas and stuff like that i don't really use it too much but it's a nice little addition all right so as y'all know I'm doing a 50 subscriber giveaway. So as soon as I reach 50 subscribers, I'm doing two giveaways, a saltwater giveaway and a freshwater giveaway. Now I'm stuck at 46 subscribers right now. And um, I really wanna get to 50. So I'm gonna show you a few more things that I'm including in the boxes for those who win. Let's start with the saltwater edition. So the first thing that I'm adding for the saltwater edition is this little puppy right here a nice bucktail jig look at that look how nice that looks look at the shape of the head look at the quality of the feathers this is nice really really nice if you guys know how to fish bucktail jigs you guys are going to really enjoy this this is a let me see if it says it one ounce gizzard shad bucktail jig so you guys are going to really enjoy using this i'm including this in the saltwater edition box also i'm including this catch co pro series baits i gotta say this is a weird looking bait look at that it's like a paddle tail or a grub kind of thing but the tail looks so weird look at that how it looks but you never know Catch Co. or Lucky Tackle Box is including that um, in one of the boxes that I got before. So I'm going to include that as well. And lastly, I'm going to include these puppies. More little uh, grubs for the saltwater edition, courtesy of Big Bite Baits. That's what's being included. Apart from everything else that you guys saw on the other video, link is up here. Um, this is all going to be included in the saltwater edition tackle box. Let's do the fresh water now. All right. So for the fresh water edition i'm going to be adding the following baits charlie's worms scented black or dark blue or purplish baits and these smell really nice i mean if you open them up 
and you smell them, they smell really nice. They smell like kind, kind of like candy, like licorice kind of thing. So they smell actually pretty darn good. And um, they're like the finesse worms, the trick worms. So you could use this on a shaky head or uh, just on a Texas rig to get a strike. This worm is going to be really, really good. I'm also including another Lake Lunkers trick style or finesse style uh, worms in the color blue. So you guys will be able to use this also on a shaky head or on a Texas rig, um, you know, to get those bass to strike. And lastly, I'm going to be including this little number right here. It is a title shot jitter jig. It's a, a half an ounce with a five aught hook. Now, this is kind of like a spinner bait, kind of like a chatter bait, kind of. Um, and also, I don't even know what to call it, to be honest with you. It's like a mix of different baits. And the cool thing is that it actually brings a replacement trailer. So you see the jig head right here with the spinner. You see it's like a little grub with uh, the curly tail. Down here, you actually have another replacement trailer of the little jig with, or, or the little um, grub with the paddle tail. And interestingly enough, in the back, it actually gives you instructions on how to rig, how to fish. So you'll be able to use that to your advantage. So I'm including these three things as well in the tackle boxes that I'm going to be providing for you guys in the 50 subscriber giveaway. All right, guys. So right now, um, I want to get real with you guys because my goal is to try to upload at least two videos a week. But the truth is that this week has been a little bit rough on me in terms of uploading videos. My daughter got sick at the beginning of the week and I was out of commission for a couple days while she was sick and then she got me sick. So I wasn't feeling too good. I wasn't able to go out and, you know, do fishing like I usually do. And even though I tried during my lunch break at work to get something on video for you guys, truth of the matter is nothing was biting. I couldn't get anything to strike. I couldn't get anything to bite. So here's where I want to ask you guys. A lot of these YouTube channels, you know, they kind of have this perception, at least they do in my case, where they always go out and they're always catching fish. Truth of the matter is, in my personal experience from what I've seen, you don't always catch fish when you go out fishing. You know, sometimes you spend an hour, like I do, and you catch three or four fish. But other times you spend an hour, two hours, three hours, and maybe you only catch one fish or you don't catch any fish. So my question to you guys is, do you guys want me to upload videos only when I catch fish? Or do you want to see the real life experience where you could go fishing for an hour and not catch anything? You know, I'm torn between these two scenarios because truth is, if you guys want realistic videos where I go fishing, even if I don't catch anything, I'll be able to upload two videos a week, no problem. But if you guys want only videos where I'm actually catching stuff, that might be a little bit more difficult because I don't always catch fish when I go out. And so that happens to pretty much every fisherman. Not every fisherman catches fish every time they go out. So I want your opinion. Do you guys want videos only when I catch fish? Or do you want the realism of fishing and upload even when I don't catch anything? So leave a comment down below uh, in regards to what do you guys think. I really want to hear your, your opinion. And once I reach 50 subscribers, guys, which I'm only four away, four away, then I'll be doing this giveaway for you guys. So please, please, please share this. Comment, subscribe, like, you know, all the good stuff. Promote that video so I could do the giveaway soon and give this out to the lucky winners. Again, remember, when I reach 100 subscribers, I'm going to be doing another giveaway. So let's get to 50 and then let's get to 100 to give the other giveaway. And again, thank you guys so much for you know supporting my channel, for subscribing, for liking my videos, for viewing my videos. I really do appreciate that. And hopefully if the weather is good and I feel better by this Sunday, I'm going to head out to the pier and do some fishing and hopefully catch something good for you guys. So thank you guys so much. See you guys in the next video. Bye.